Now for Eyewitness News, call 12 for action. Tonight, a warning about the latest security risk to your finances. It's called ATM super skimming, and security experts say anyone who uses an ATM is at risk. Problem solver Susan Hogan joins us now with the details. The gear being used to swipe your information is more sophisticated than ever. And the latest statistic is shocking. Call 12 for Action asked security experts for details on how you can protect yourself. Lori Briggs uses her debit card for everything from groceries to gas. My husband went to get gas one day and the card was denied. <laughs> we knew we had money, so we were quite surprised. A quick call to the bank and Lori learned more than $400 was swiped. Our account was at zero. <laughs> we didn't know how we were going to pay the bills. Lori's bank now believes she was the victim of ATM skimming. Skimming is the unauthorized capture of your debit or credit card's magnetic strip data. It can happen during routine ATM transactions. False card readers and hidden wireless cameras are used by thieves to swipe bank account information and your PIN number. They'll download that information and they'll have it and with that information they will go create a, a, a bogus card. Or they'll sell the information online. Theft from ATM skimming now tops at one billion dollars annually. If it's a well done crime, it's something that looks just, you know, that looks just like that which you would typically use when you swipe your card. Some are so discreet that they can even be attached to the outside of an ATM vestibule or even at a gas pump. We didn't notice anything in, in particular that was suspicious. But it's important to look. Start by performing an ATM inspection. Check the card reader to ensure it's secure. Uh, telltale signs such as uh, tape sticking out of a portion of the ATM or out of the pin pad or tape residue or glue residue where something has been applied. Then look around the ATM, scan the ceiling and any brochure racks. Wireless cameras likely to be installed immediately above the ATM, within the ATM, or in the ceiling. To protect your PIN number, Call 12 for Action also recommends cupping your hand over the keypad so no one can see over your shoulder. Just so you know, you're not held liable for fraudulent losses, but it is still important to play detective if you are skimmed. File a fraud report with your bank stat. That's what Lori did, and her money was returned the very next day, thankfully. And if you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1, hotline 228-1850. I'm problem solver Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.